Okay, so today we are going to open the Sam's Club um, Pokemon box set, or however you like to call it. This retails for about, I want to say $29, about $3 cheaper than the Costco one. So let's just rip this open. Okay. So I believe it comes with, I want to say like eight booster packs. Um, all kinds of some random stuff that you probably don't need, like notebooks, stickers, and all that fun stuff to make it look like it's worth something. I feel like if you make content where it's focusing on your hands, I feel like people look at your features of your hands. So yeah, I got my nails done. Not important, but let's open all this stuff. is gonna like unravel the most annoying way it possibly can. So just birthday present. Unnecessary. Oh look it didn't even open all the way. Okay. So we got a Pokeball with looks like we I know this is like as part of like the game, but like as collectors, what do you like? What do you do with your coins? Is there like a coin like coin carry thing? Like I don't know. So it comes with a sword and shield pack. We have a rebel clash and a darkness blaze. Comes with um, a big old fat Pikachu and um, gnarly looking Charizard. <laughs> I haven't been in the Pokemon game for such a long time. I've played since I was like little, like, I guess you would say like in the 90s, Pokemon Red, Blue, um, you know, the yellow version for the Game Boy came out. And I hate to be that person that's like, I'm a first gener, but it's kind of been that long since I've, you know, got into it, but it kind of looked fun. I wanted to get back into it. And so here I am. So it looks like it comes with three foil cards featuring the probably the three starters for this generation. Um, five TCG booster packs and so much more. So let's open this up. So we open up this way. I'm guessing this is like the three starters for that generation. So inside the tin, it looks like you get your three foils and this gnarly looking coin what what do you do with the coin though exactly like i mean i guess you play with it but like does anybody actually hold on to these like i'm sure i'll probably hold on to it because i feel like there's some sort of value with it but i want to know what like people do like what is a creative thing to do with those coins and then you get so here's the stuff that i want stuff in the bottom of whatever Here's a code. Go ahead and use it. Um, I'm probably not gonna use it, so go ahead and use it. Whoever even watches it. So, looks like we got a vivid voltage, a another vivid voltage, rebel clash, sword and shield, and sword and shield. So, got all those boosters. Let's just start with this kind of stuff. So you get your, which is like unnecessary. Like, I mean, it's cool, but it's kind of unnecessary. Like you get your giant stickers. Like, what do you stick these on though? Like, I mean, they're not good stickers. They're okay stickers. They're not good stickers. You can't stick them on your car or anything, but they're like, they're okay. But it's like the shapes they like put them into and like specifically, like it's just, I don't know. It just doesn't look like it's like, seeing in this too, it's like, I mean the concept is really cool like don't get me wrong but like what do you actually like 
just like little kids they put them on their binders and stuff but like to be honest like are we really is this really for little kids anymore or is it for like your typical like scalper or your typical i don't know like dude that like collects things or girl like doesn't matter who you are but it's like i i feel like the generation i like your journal book write all your groceries on it or your to-do lists or whatever things you need to do in your life besides you know collecting a little kid game and then your card holder promo card holder your big fat pikachu and your gnarly looking charizard um i mean it's cool but it's like i mean it's like i don't i would never use this probably use like an actual binder or maybe like keep the cards in the tin until i get a binder but I mean, I guess it's A for effort. I don't know. So, yeah. It comes with all that unnecessary stuff. All those back. Once again, here is a little uh, close up with the foil cards. The ones that are like the promo cards for them. They're cool. It's cool. It's not what I want, but it's cool. Um, so. Of course, every time I attempt to do YouTube or do something related to YouTube, like, there's always a technical, like, oh god, my dog's in here. There's always a technical, like, the camera's dead, I don't have enough memory, my SD card, my computer's not working. So I was like, nope, today is the day I go take responsibilities and I charge my battery to my camera. So, hopefully this setup looks a little bit better than previously. So, let's open some cards, shall we? What should we start first? Maybe... I mean, I guess Rebel Clash. I feel like there's nothing that ever comes good with these. And by the way, I like to say, all these like packs always look like they're tampered with. I don't know. They're like way too easy to open. See? Way too easy to open compared to other Pokemon cards. It's just... And... I like to, oh god, I just spoiled it for myself. Great. Okay, so, like Max Mofo says, three to the back. Get rid of your energy. Alrighty. So, I'm not even gonna pretend to know some of these. I'm just going to do a speed run and see if we get anything good. First hollow trainer card. And yeah, so we already knew that this pack would be trash. I guess apparently from people told me those online card things, if you get a green card, you just have a trash pack and like like it's not even worth even opening. I spoiled it for myself. I guess we'll do a sword and shield pack. Is your code um so three to the back get rid of that energy alrighty speed run holding's a good one one of the originals Silly is good too. Ooh, reverse hollow goldine. I actually really like that because, like I said, one of the originals, one of the now, and. Puga, please, you're ruining my video. So, anyways, reverse goldine. 
Let's see what we get next. Oh, it's a Snorlax. I mean, not a special card, but still Snorlax. I don't take that as a loss. I take that as a very okay present. So, not bad. Let's open, let's open a Vivid Voltage. We haven't opened any Vivid Voltage. I'm a little bit more hopeful for these packs too, compared to the other ones. So this one's probably not sealed. Well, maybe it is. See, why is it so easy? Compared to like buying single pack from Target, it's so easy to open it. Alright. <coughs> I mean, <laughs> okay, I always forget. Okay, so obviously gonna be a trash pack. Um, one, two, three. Get rid of your energy. All right, speed run. Oh, want to pick favorites, Clefairy. Doesn't that look like the hand guy from like SpongeBob, like the hand mascot, or is it just me? <sighs> okay, Reverse Hollow Lucario. Not bad. And some trash alligator dude. Okay, well, not bad again. Um, we've yet to see a white or a call say white card, basically, because like green cards are trash. So not bad. I'm not disappointed, but I'm not happy either. So uh, let's see. We'll do. A darkness ablaze since it's new. ASMR. Here's your codes. Two. So one, two, three. Get rid of your energy. Hopefully, we get a good one. really like this one too. I mean she's beyond my time but she's still pretty. Mm. Fun fact, this one was always in my party too. I swear you're gonna hear me say that a million times but like there is specific ones that were always in my party and that was one of them that was always in my party. <sighs> I could never get my hands on like original Pikachu so I'd have like you know you obviously get one electric type in your party. And that'd be the one, because I really like my name. It's, you know, cute. It's cute. So, let's see. Wow, not a surprise. Another green card. Okay, let's open this one. I really, really want this Lapras. My sister got this Lapras. I really want this Lapras. So, let's see. Huh. <laughs> it for myself again. <sighs> Finally, a white card. I need to open these more. Okay. Get rid of your energy. It's a leaf. We are manifesting a nice, nice card. Okay. Trainer. Wow. Three trainers. Brazilia. Rhyhorn. Sobble. Grokey. This reverse hollow and uh, I mean it's very underwhelming like it's a hollow it's cool looking but I really just wanted like some sort of full art or something I know I'm sounding greedy but <sighs> we're getting there it's better than the last two but I'm gonna let my dog choose out of the three which one do I choose Okay. She went for the Lapras Sword and Shield one first. Should have probably recorded that, but it's the first one she went for. Okay. I think 
not super buttery easy to open. If I'm doing this correct, it's this way. Here's your code for all you code people. Okay. One, two, three. Energy. All right. Pokemon Slater Center Lady. So, not Nurse Joy. Goldeen again. We meet again, Miss Goldeen. Our reverse hollow. Wow! Oh! Oh! You know, I'm not mad. I'm not mad. I really, really like her. I'm not mad. Oh, this is so nice. This is so nice. I'm not mad. I'm really not mad. I really, really like Marnie. I like. Fun fact. Let's see. <gasps> oh, and it's a white card. So fun fact. Um, I really like like her a lot, and I got into this way too late. And she has like boxes of her own. And I. I don't want to say I paid scalper price, but I paid scalper price for some of her stuff because I really, really like her a lot. Wow, that's a really, really, really good card. I'm really happy with that one. Wow. Should I display it? Do I have any display things? I don't. I'll just leave her like separated. This is really, I'm, I'm so happy. <sighs> Maybe I should like, um, include the prices. I mean, it's not about the price, right? It's about the card, but I'm gonna leave this up here. Um, uh, reminder to find me a price for this card. Uh, actually, I'll put it on here. Keep it more safe. Okay. Wow, my dog picked that one. Anyways, Vivid Voltage or Rebel Clash. We'll do Rebel Clash and we'll keep the Vivid Voltage for last. Okay. Here's your code, code people. Keep that on the ground. And one, two, three. Energy. Okay. Mm. Magic card. Look how cute. Look how cute. He's like, hello. Excuse me, if I'm up there. Okay. Okay. Look at, I'm, you know, I'm not mad at the trainer cards. I really like them. Our reverse and. Eh. So this is most likely a green card. Yep. Green card. Not that bad. We still got Marnie, though. It's still a winner in my book. Even though, literally, like my sister, her opening with this box like three good good cards <sighs> but still as long as i got marty in okay last card out of the sam sam i was gonna say sam <laughs> sam club i spoiled myself that's in the back okay doesn't mean i'm gonna spoil you though here is our code for those code people. Okay. Celebi. Is this like hollow? Oh, it's so pretty. Is this like special? I feel like it's special. Uh, I don't know, but it's pretty. I really like it. I like Solomie. I'm not gonna throw that one. Oh, and a Vaporeon. So Vaporeon's not that bad. <sighs> the Solomie's really pretty though. And of course, green card. So, what do you guys think? Do you think I won? Am I a winner? Or do you think that this card is sound whatever? Sam Club box is uh, a dud and I kind of got ripped off. 
I mean, for the amount you pay, you get a decent amount of cards. I'm sure that probably hurt, like, people's feelings. The people that, like, hardcore collect that I slammed it. Like that. But, we're gonna honorable mention. We are gonna mention our hollow Marnie card. And we are gonna honorable mention our... I don't want... It's not, like... It is holographic, but it's not. I don't know. But it's, like, so pretty. Hey, everybody. I'm back. And we are opening a Costco 3-pack. This video is going to be geared towards um, what's more worth it as far as... Well, we're not going to do... Party, we're not going to do, like, quantity, but what as far as worth it, like, as in... Should I buy the Sam's Club Pokemon pack or should I buy the Costco? So, right off the bat, you do get... You do get three promos in the front. You get an uh, entire tent and you get two Pokeballs compared to the Sam's Club, where they get one Pokeball. So, I mean, so far, I would like to say Costco stays winning. Costco always stays winning, regardless of Pokemon or anything. They got the better food, they got the better atmosphere, they got less cringe people there. It's always been winning. I hate Sam's Club. It goes up because. I kind of suck at stuff like that. This is why I've never had a successful YouTube career because I just like record and then I'll like edit and then I'll hate the way I sound and then I'll never upload it. So if I got past recording, I like to say I'm very proud of myself. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. So I'm taking this off camera because I don't want to damage the promo card more than the card is bent we got one ball out and like can I say like the way they put I guess this is aesthetic and everything but this is really just like annoying to take out so I'm just gonna leave that in the background I'll take it out later that are tin our tin and let's see try to take this ball out and we got our ultra ball ball so everything's out after struggling let's just I don't even really want to record the opening of these because I'm sure like on the other side this is extremely frustrating so, no matter what it takes. Oh, right on top of her bench promo. All right, well, um, I did record this like four days ago. Um, my camera died maybe at like midnight to one o'clock in the morning and I did not want to stay up for it to charge, so. But I did keep myself a promise. I'm gonna complete this first unboxing. So at least I get some sort of credit. So we ended up um, opening these up. This is the Costco bundle. I believe it is 20, I think it's like 30 something. 30, $3, I think it's like three more dollars compared to the Sam's Club box. But you also get way more, but that's always been a thing like Costco always has like better deals than Sam's Club in general, so I'm not surprised. Um, okay. so all that's open. Let's see what you get in the tin. So it says packed with Pokemon Treasure, three foil cards featuring Vaporeon, Jolteon, and Flareon, five TCG booster packs and so much more so I'm guessing more cards and more junk that we don't need but we like so what I'm gonna do maybe I'm gonna open the pokeballs first so open that up It's so hard with nails. Okay. Open. We got the same 
Vinte. Uh, I think it's his name. Same coin. Two names in here, something like that. Yeah. So same coin. Three more boosters. We got Sword and Shield, Rebel Clash, and Darkness Ablaze. Open this one now. Off camera, because I can't do it. Okay. That one was easier. So same coin. Um, Sword and Shield, Rebel Clash, Darkness Ablaze. So I feel like you get better packs in the Sam's. Oh, oh see my sleeve. I feel like you get better packs in the Sam's Club box than this box because I don't know. I just feel like they're better packs. So let's start with Rebel Clash and we'll just go through it. I forgot since it's been like four days. I forgot like which way is best to open it. Okay, this way. Okay, so we got an open. You know the drill. Um, here's your code. One, two, three. Get rid of that energy. The fairy. I reverse hollow and ooh, okay. So we got a V. Um, our first V in like forever, but we got a V. Not the most exciting one, but it will do. It makes me happy. So let me see if that's my theory is right. Yep, white card. So theory so far is right. So I consider it a win, even though it's like not the most exciting like Pokemon, but it's still a win. Darkness please. See, some of these are like flipped upside down, so. Maybe spoiler, I got a trash pack, but let's see. Reverse hollow and nothing. So, Davy's kind of right. <sighs> I mean, I prefer not to see the color though, like, so I could at least be surprised, but I think some of these are like put in different directions, so I'll just never know which is what. All right, so we'll do a sword and shield. We already got one of these. It's still pretty cool. Um, <gasps> yeah! Yeah! Oh, I'm so excited. Um, my sister literally got a Lapras. I think she had a VMAX, so still so cool. I really love Lapras a lot. Wow, that's awesome. I mean, I sound super monotone just because I have some allergies going on right now, but <sighs> it's pretty cool. Yeah, it's a win! I'll put the price of, I mean, not that it matters, but 
Makes me feel good, you know? You know what this deserves? This deserves a display. Oh. There you go. You can admire it while I do everything. Okay, so let's see. White card. All right. So good so far. Okay. So I'm gonna do the darkness of blaze, and my theory is they put the cards in backwards for the code. So I'm gonna flip the card this time, so I don't see the color. Alrighty. So I'm gonna flip it this way. Yep. Okay. So here's our code. And oh. One, two, three, energy. All right. Reverse hollow. There we go. <laughs> Yeah, so let's check the colors. Yep, trash pack. We still got the Lapras though. That's the only thing that motivating me right now is that Lapras. Right over there. I mean, watch it be worth like only $2, but you know, I don't care. It just makes me feel good, you know? Makes me feel better than buying a single card at like Frankincense because it's like, I actually earned it. Okay, so sword and shield. And eventually, I want to get a better setup than what I have right now. It's not bad, it's not terrible, but I feel like I need better lighting. Okay, so here's your code. Cute. Reverse. And cute. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. I'm mad, but I'm not mad. Last purple clash and the Pokeballs. Point of view of like I have like a week grown out nails now, so it's like they're even longer and less manageable. But I don't want to spend more money <laughs> right now to get them done again. So that feels like that's a waste too soon to get them done. But I think maybe I'll get them done like two weeks or something. Just use what I have for now. Like super cool ass like um what is it called? What is that called again? Um crochet. I really like this art a lot. Kinda have some hope for this one. Let's see. 
No. But Nine Tails is super good too, so not mad. Let's see. Green. Okay, so one V out of the entire six packs I opened. I don't know if that's a good ratio. It's probably a horrible ratio, but we shall continue with the tin now. Give me a second to restart my setup. And we're back. So we're now gonna open the EV box or tin. What you get in it? So of course so. So this is the front. You get your three promos with your big ol' EV coin. I'm not gonna take these out just because I have another set already and I don't, it's like really weird with the tabs. You don't want to bend the cards. I'd rather not do it on camera. So those are your promos. Here's some up close action of them. And the big ol' EV coin. So in this pack, looks like you get Two chilling rain on this side, and you get a. I can't even do this one. Okay, let me see. You get a vivid voltage, rebel clash, sword and shield, and you also get an additional code card. Go ahead and use that for me. After you open this portion up, ah. And the same setup here. We got some evolution stickers. Like these stickers are cute, but it's like, what do you actually put them on? I know I said that the first time, but I genuinely want to know. Like, <laughs> what do you use these for? Because they're so like they're so odd, the shapes of them. And then your notepad, which I prefer this one over the one we got from Sam's Club, and then your little binder where you keep all your cards that you bought today in. So, let's back. Collector's tin. So, fun fact, um, my boyfriend, my mom, my mom's, or my boyfriend's mom, they all bought me one pack because I think maybe it was hard for me to find at the time and then I asked if anyone's going to Costco please pick me up one and then I ended up with four of them so I swear I'm not a scalper I just have people that care about me a lot but I'm not going to need four lunch boxes so eventually maybe I'll do a giveaway or something Let's see if this like channel even goes anywhere, but I'd love to give one away or two because nobody needs that much, like that many lunch boxes. I don't think. So we're gonna start off, start off with chilling rain. your code. Energy. Okay. Yeah, this is pretty cool. Reverse and it was not a good pack. That's okay. I really thought, like, since we got so many trainers cards in the beginning, I was finally gonna get another, like, trainer holographic card, but it's okay. So, I don't want to do another chilling rain. I'll do sword and shield. We'll keep Vivid Voltage for the end because I like, that's the packs I like go for. Just because you can get more good stuff from them, but. 
in these packs. She's cute. It's really good art though. I really like it. Even though like, she's cute, but it's not what we're looking for. She's cute. This art's cute. Yeah, at least we get some good art. Look at it. Reverse and Okay, so we got a hollow. I mean, for some reason I prefer full arts and V's, V maxes, but this is cool. And then look, look in the corner. That's your girl, the one we just pulled. Cute, okay, well, not bad. That's my dog in the background, by the way, not me. white card so we'll do rebel clash next Two packs left. If I don't get a V in any of these packs, I'm gonna be really disappointed. For some reason, like I was telling my boyfriend when we were doing his unboxing, I was like, they look buttery, easy to open. And I'm like, you think they just resell them? He thinks I'm like crazy, but you don't really like anybody that's gotten these Costco packs and Sam's Club packs. I haven't pulled like something that good out of them. Like, I don't know. Maybe I just have trust issues. camera seems to go in and out of focus, but I'm guessing it's like the big issue with this specific camera I have. Oh fuck, okay. Uh, God. <laughs> what am I doing? I just, <laughs> I just ruined it. Okay, here's the code. Is it even worth even doing the three to back? I'm just gonna... Reverse. Hollow. Your energy. Trainer and trainer. Okay, now we're gonna open the Vivid Voltage. I have so much faith that they're gonna give me a good card. Because they cannot give me not a good card in the entire thing. I mean, this should be guaranteed at least one really good card. Give me a good card, please. Yep. Another disappointment. Why am I not surprised? Like I said, my theory of them reselling it. Oh my god, Puka, shh. Shh. I'm recording. 
the theory of them resealing it is getting stronger I'm getting more doubtful so um, that was my complete unboxing of the Costco versus um, versus Sam's Club um, I'm not sure if I gave you like a close up of those so I mean for the price you pay you get a pretty big amount of cards compared to like buying something from I don't know like a something like just a normal deck box you get a lot of cards uh, we also got let me show this off got the tin with the fat Pikachu and the paper. I'm pretty sure I did show this off but just to make sure here I'll put that right next to the box all right thank you for watching my first unboxing um I really appreciate it hopefully I did pretty good had high expectations um yeah I really want to start doing more of this kind of stuff and uh, I have a lot of figures and statues and you know mangas and stuff I'd like to talk about so hopefully you guys like my content and it will motivate me to keep going so anyways I'm not gonna ask you to like share whatever because you can do whatever you want um if you want to that would help me out um but anyways thanks for hanging out and I'll see you next time bye